and the Beast. Chapter 2 A Rose and a Promise. As the family was adjusting to their shack life, unexpected news arrived. One of the ships thought to be lost at sea returned to the local harbor. All the children were hopeful and waited eagerly for the good news. They hoped the returned ship contained riches that would make them wealthy again. Are we moving back to our big house again? We don't like living in the shack! The road back to the harbor was long and tiring. But the merchant, seeing how excited they were, decided to leave right away. I'll go and see how the ship is. If all the goods are still there, we should have enough money to return to our old house. Really? Could you buy us necklaces? Or what about chef-made food? We really crave some homemade pies. But Rose was a little different. Father, just return safely. That's all I want. Rose's siblings leered at her. We can't stand her. She's so annoying. The merchant was quite pleased, but he wanted to make her happy too. Rose, tell me what you like. I want to get it for you. Rose answered. Then bring me one rose. I like roses. Thank you, father. The merchant had no time to waste and left in a hurry. Upon arrival, he learned that his crew had already left with the goods. They thought the merchant had died. Oh no, there's nothing left. The Beast Casting Narrator Emma Kim Father David Yu Rose Rina Kwan Music Dr. Lee Presented by 2022 Fall Semester JC's Podcast Club